Hello everyone, Rob Cohe, Technical Evangelist for Autodesk Manufacturing. You know, throughout this web series, I've been talking about how our customers are experiencing the benefits of digital prototyping. Nowhere is that more evident than with our simulation line of products. I'm here with Bob Williams. Bob is a product marketing manager for our simulation products. And Bob, tell us a little bit about Autodesk Simulation and how those tools help our customers. Yeah, when we talk about simulation, we always say that it does three key things. So we say that it helps you validate designs, it helps you predict product performance, and it helps you optimize designs. Yep. So historically, it's always been used to validate designs. Validate designs is, I have a design, I know what the loading is, I know what the environment is, let me just make sure, let me verify that it behaves the way I think. Predicting product performance is more about, I have a product, I know its environment, honestly, I'm not quite sure how it's gonna behave. Sure. The area of simulation that still really is untapped is design optimization, because Simulations historically have been sort of a time-consuming process. Oftentimes, someone might get through one simulation, but that's about it. Right. In order to truly optimize a design, you need to be doing simulation from the very beginning, and it needs to be something that you study a lot of alternatives. So things like inventor optimization mm -hmm. technology that, that we've had out there available as a preview, um, these, these are tools that then can perform 500 simulations Right. And guess what? It also filters the results. It goes in and it says, take a look at these five. You look at it and you say, you know what? That is a great change that should be made to my design. You accept it and there you are, back in Inventor with an optimized design. All right, so let's, let's talk a little bit about the 2012 um, enhancements that we've made to our simulation offerings. Um, we've done some great work in the UI. Last year, our mold flow product line uh, was released with the same user interface as you see in Venner. You know, we call it the ribbon toolbar. Sure. And with this year 2012 launch, we now have that exact same user interface inside of our Autodesk Simulation Mechanical and Autodesk Simulation Multi Physics products. So, um, what are some other things that you're excited about in uh, for 2012? So in addition to, to the ease of use, e ease of learning that we've talked about, um, if we look at the simulation mechanical and simulation multi-physics products, we continue to do a lot with interoperability. If we look at interoperability within our simulation portfolio, we already have tight integration between our simulation mechanical, simulation multi-physics products with our mold flow products. In addition to the interoperability with our simulation tools, we continue to do a lot to uh, integrate further into our design tools. Mm -hmm. um, so we, we included Fusion in now with the uh, Inventor Simulation and uh, the Moldflow products, right? Yes. What's so that going to do for our customers, do you think? What that does is it completely just changes the simulation workflow. So whether you're someone looking to do simplification or someone looking to make modifications as part of an optimization process, Fusion plugs right into that. I take my geometry, I can real-time, direct modeling, use this tool, push, pull, modify the geometry, jump right back into my simulation tool, and continue working through this iterative process. Yep. Again, putting simulation in the process, not as an afterthought at the end, but right. part of as I'm working through. So, so Bob, I think that we play very well um, with others in the industry. Um, and uh, being able to use Fusion almost as a translator because of all the things that we can read. Even if you don't use our modeling tool for yep. engineering, you can still use Autodesk simulation tools. Yeah, with our simulation products, we have a real emphasis on being CAD neutral. We understand that people that need to perform simulation are using one or possibly multiple packages. Absolutely. So all of our simulation products have tight and, and direct support for a wide range of CAD packages. Not only Fusion, as, as you mentioned, but those tools specifically, simulation mechanical, simulation multi-physics, and mold flow, they themselves directly, even if you don't come in through the Fusion workflow, they can read in a wide range of geometry from other CAD packages as well. You know, Bob, what I'm hearing throughout this series is, is uh, the ease of use, the consistency and ease of use messages with everybody that I talk to. Um, and, and the breadth of our simulation offering is just absolutely incredible. Um, from an ease of use standpoint, making sure the consistency in the UI is there throughout the products that we were talking about, and interoperability between all the tools is really important. So I'm really excited about the Simulation 2012 line of props. Bob, thanks so much. No problem, Ron.